What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys want to be no notified for future readings, uh, smash the sub button. It notifies you of future readings. Just saying. This is for the sign of Leo. Weekly, week four reading for the sign of Leo. This will resonate if you have Leo in any aspects of your chart. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, or the moon, energy of your charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Um... Um, I got two channeled in as I was meditating on your energy. I apologize. It was supposed to be out October 20th of 2021. I had every intention of doing it. But that was the night I got arrested. So I apologize. My readings are not out sooner. I had every intention of doing it that night, but I didn't realize I was going to get arrested and they were going to cart my kids away. So I apologize about that. So, um, I'm back. Just saying. All right, here we go. So the first um, message I received was a very judgmental Leo is about to get a serious dose of reality very soon. Um, that was the first one. And the second one I heard a very high, vib high vibrational Leo is about to get serious blessings come their way soon. So you plug that in. It's like yin and yang. Um, just saying. So you plug it in however that resonates. If that resonates with you, spirit messages you have on Leo. So a very judgmental Leo is about to get a harsh dose of reality soon. So something in this Leo's life, it sounds like a very low, low vibrational Leo. Um, they're very materialistic and greedy. Very. They're about to experience many heavy negative power moments. Okay, so you plug that in, how it resonates. I heard they're very materialistic and greedy, and they're about to experience many heavy neg negative power moments. So this... Uh, judgmental leo they're very low low vibrational you know vibrations have nothing to do with money um it just doesn't it's how you treat people honesty respect integrity loyalty about um um honor ethics that kind of thing they're low vibrational they don't apparently um and they're very greedy and materialistic i heard so they're low vibrational but i heard they're about to get very heavy negative power moments soon um in their life i think it's probably going to affect their money is what I'm thinking, but it could affect them in other ways, but you plug it in, however that resonates, that resonates with um, you or somebody you're connected to. But then I heard a high vibrational Leo is about to start receiving very um, many blessings from the universe. So we've got a low vibrational Leo, a high vibrational Leo, um, yin and yang, and um, it sounds like the scales are going to start balancing out. Um, which we are in Scorpio Scorpio season right now, which is transformation and change, and so that's that's good. That's good, that's good. So you plug that in, however that resonates, if that resonates with you, this could be Master or Fem Leo. This could be Master or Fem Leo. You have to plug yourself in, how you fit. You could be one of these people or somebody connected to one of these people. The Emperor Reverse, Three of Cups Upright. A particular high vibrational Leo has had a very, very, very narcissistic co-parent in their life for a very long time. Many serious tower moments are about to happen for this. Negative serious tower moments are about to happen for this co-parent. It's about to really free this Leo away from this narcissistic person. Finally. Okay, so you plug it in however that resonates. Well, congrats whoever that's for. My goodness, that, that's terrible. So I, I think it's this high vibrational Leo or another high vibrational Leo, however that resonates. But they're high vibrational, so you treat people with honesty, loyalty, respect, integrity, values, things of that nature. Um, and like I said, high, vibrations have nothing to do with money. So um, you plug that in how that resonates. But I heard you've had to deal with a very, very narcissistic controlling um uh co-parent so somebody that um is a father or mother of your children in some shape form or fashion either one child or two plus children um but you've had i heard for years you've had to deal with them for years so you know um but they're very controlling they're very controlling very narcissistic they love to they want to control you or they do control you or they try to control you and obviously the, the children as well but they do it 
for control purposes and manipulation purposes. And you've had to deal with this crap for years, apparently, if this resonates with you. But I heard basically many heavy negative power moments are about to occur for this um, very toxic, narcissistic co-parent. And it's about to free you away from this person. Um, and it's going to piss them off in a huge way. But it needs to be done. Okay. And I heard it's going to piss them off in a huge way, but it needs to be done. So it's going to, it sounds like it's legal. It sounds like it's legal. And you're probably going to go through the legal system for this, um, if this resonates with you. So you'll have to probably, I mean, you'll have to, is what I'm presuming. Um, and there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, you have to protect yourself. You have to protect yourself. You have to protect your children. You have to protect yourself. But it sounds like it's affecting you and your children. Um, and it, not in a positive way so somebody's health could be going down your health could be going down your child or children's health could be going down something is negatively affecting this dynamic but it's the co-parent that is precipicing precipicing this i can't speak they are um they are basically uh, initializing I can't speak. They, they, um, they are a big cause of factor of why somebody's health is going down. Is basically what I'm trying to say. Either your health or ch uh, your child's health or everybody's health or something's going down in this situation, but it's because they're being so controlling and um, narcissistic, basically, to you and the children or child. But I heard um, many have any negative power moments are about to occur for this uh, co-parent. And it's going to release you away from this person and it's going to piss them off. And of course, it's going to piss them off because they're narcissistic. They love control. They love control. They love control. So, of course, it's going to piss them off. But I heard it, it needs to be done for probably for your sanity, your health, your mental health, your medical, your child's mental health, medical, um, for everybody's health. Um, I mean, absolutely. So, this is the um, when um the heavy negative tell moments occur for the co-parent they won't have control anymore it sounds like right now they have control in some shape form or fashion and makes them happy and then you will be celebrating because um it sounds like you're going through legal issues right now is exactly what it sounds like or you're about to so you plug it in however that resonates spirit messages you have for sign of leo A very low vibrational Leo is about to try to come back into a high vibrational Leo like Leo's life soon. It really would not be smart, high vibrational Leo. Okay, so you plug it in, how that resonates, if that resonates for you. I heard a low vibrational Leo is going to try to attempt to come back into a high vibrational Leo's life. So high vibrational Leo, we are pulling in low and high, so high vibrational leo if this resonates with you i heard a low vibrational leo is going to try to attempt to come back into your life i heard from spirit it would not be a good idea so you have to plug it in your life however that resonates if that resonates for you use your best discernment logic and judgment and reasoning um, if that resonates with you high vibrational leo it is a low vibrational leo so no honesty trust loyalty respect they don't have values or ethics they probably live outside the law break the rules and um not healthy they're not healthy and they want to come back into your life probably to energy succubus off you or to steal your money your time your energy etc etc our urban spirit it wouldn't be a good idea of course you can choose to listen to the messages or not use your best discernment and logic and reasoning so um you plug it in how it resonates queen of pentacles upright ace of pentacles reversed Someone is going to try to come, business owner Leo, someone's going to try to come into your life to try to collaborate with you, with your business. All they see is dollar signs. Beware. Okay, so you plug it in, how that resonates, if that resonates with you. 
Um, this is for a business owner, Leo. You can be master owner, Fem, but you own a business of some shape, form, or fashion. It could be a sole proprietorship or LLC. You plug it in how it fits, but you own a business of some shape, form, or fashion. But I heard basically um, someone's going to try to come into your life and try to collaborate with you. Um, I heard all they see is dollar signs. So they're seeing you as a money magnet, basically. And um, apparently your business is doing well or it's about to start doing well. Um, and they know this. They know this. They're highly intuitive. But they use their powers on the dark side and not the light side. And they basically want to mooch off you. They want to mooch off you for the money. Um, so I would suggest using your best discernment and logic and reasoning with this person. Um, if you're doing well on your own, you know, of course you have the free will and to allow this person to collaborate with you. But all they're seeing, our from spirit, all they're seeing is dollar signs. So, you know, just saying, just saying. Of course, use your best discernment, logic, and reasoning with this person. So, Queen of Pentacles upright. Um, they're seeing you as the Queen of Pentacles upright. They're seeing you as money, 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 money. That's how they're seeing you. Stable, grounded, reliable, dependable. You're a business owner, and you're either doing well or you're about to start doing well. Um, this is Ace of Pentacles reverse. I think this is for a lot of you guys. I think you're going to refuse. Um, you're you're going to deny it. You're going to deny the collaboration, the partnership, because I, I, whoever this is for, I feel you're highly intuitive. You're highly intuitive. Whether you use your powers on the good, on the light or the dark, you know, that's, that's, I don't know. You have to plug yourself in how you resonate on that, but you're highly intuitive regardless. So I think you're going to deny them working with you in some shape, form, or fashion. That's exactly what I think. So Ace of Pentacles reverse. You plug it in how it resonates. Baby bump alert. A particular Leo was trying to hide the fact they were pregnant, but it's about to come out whether they want it to or not. Oh, whoa. So you plug it in how it fits. Whoa. I heard baby bump alert. A particular Leo was trying to hide the fact that they were pregnant, but I heard it's going to come out whether they want it to or not. So you plug it in however that resonates, if that resonates with you. For some Leos, you are on a public platform and your fans are going to feel very betrayed like you lied to them. You're going to experience severe decrease in business. Know this. Oh, God. So you plug it in how it resonates. Oh, my God. So somebody, a Leo's pregnant out there, but they're trying to hide it. Um, it's a femme Leo, or it's either a femme Leo, or you have masculine and femme parts, however that resonates. But you have the uh, proper parts to produce a child, femme parts to produce a child, whether you, um, you know, are all the way femme or femme and masculine. But you've been hiding the fact that you're pregnant. If this resonates with you, um, I heard baby bump alert. So it sounds like it's coming to the fact that people can recognize that you have a baby bump, basically. Um, so maybe you've been wearing bigger clothes, baggier clothes. Um, that's what I'm thinking. You've been wearing bigger, baggier clothes. Or it's just coming to the fact that it's forming a bump. Um, however that resonates. Um, but it's at least two or more you Leos out there in the collective. That uh, That's for sure. Because I heard at least one of you guys is on a public platform in some shape, form, or fashion. But you haven't told your fans, I heard. So you're popular in some shape, form, or fashion. Um and you haven't told your fans you have a business and you haven't told your fans that you're pregnant but i heard basically they're going to feel betrayed and lied to once it basically is found out that you are pregnant um and i heard your business is going to decrease so you plug it in however that resonates if that resonates for you um at least one of you um pregnant leos is on the public platform i'm not i'm not saying all of you are but at least one of you are so you plug it in how it resonates if that resonates for you Justice upright, seven of wands upright. A particular Leo is about to stand up for themselves in a huge, huge, huge way. Their honesty, truth, clarity. Lots of it. They're about to get justice in a huge way long overdue justice 
in lots of ways. Long overdue. Wow, this is a good one. So you plug it in how it resonates. Some through the legal system. Lots of court proceedings, but very worth it. Some universally. Their name was smeared into the mud. Defamation of character. But it's about to be made right for some vote. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates, if that resonates with you. This is a good one, Leo. So I heard basically your name was slandered in the mud, uh, if this resonates with you for some of you um, in the pu in public, like defamation of character. Uh, for some, it could be toxic family that's done this. For some, it could be toxic neighbors or frenemies or coworkers or whoever. But somebody slammed your name into the mud like nobody's business. Uh, for some, you're going to get justice universally. So people know the truth and they're going to um, basically spread the truth. Um, besides the lies and vindicate your name very publicly and um, with truth instead of lies. Thank you. And for some, you're going to get justice through the legal system um, through many court proceedings. But I heard it's going to be well worth it. Um, and you will get justice that way as well. And for some, it's both. So for some, you're going through legal issues. For some, it will be universally. Your name was just slandered into the mud in the community in a horrible way. But it's about to... Um, be amended basically and for some it's both so justice upright that's the legal proceedings you're about to go through and you're going to get lots of justice there legally it sounds like and some this is universal justice so you plug that in however it resonates for some you could be dealing with the libra because this is libra in, libra in energy or not you are they could have libra in their sun moon rising venus or sun moon or jupiter and then this is you standing up for yourself um and for some i feel it's others standing up for you as well because I heard others are going to help vindicate your name in the community because they know the truth. So for some, this is you standing up for yourself in the court of law. For some, this is others standing up for you in the community. And now that could be social media community. That could be um, physical community, um, 3D community. It could be both. You plug it in, how that resonates, if that resonates for you. Many, 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 many shocking series of chain events are going to occur with this. Many. It will definitely work out in your favor. High vibrational Leo. Okay. I heard many shocking series of chain events are going to occur with this for high vibrational Leo. And it's going to work out in your favor. And one low vibrational Leo is about to start experiencing very heavy legal issues. Very heavy. Negative power moment after negative power moment after negative power moment. They are going to be mortified. Okay. So, and it will not work out well for this Leo. Huge money loss and, and public embarrassment. Okay. So we have like a yin and yang in here. And so another low vibrational Leo is about to start experiencing legal issues as well. Lots of legal issue energy in here. Um, but they're low vibrational. So something has happened to cause these legal issues in a negative way. I heard it's not going to work out well for them at all. They're going to be very publicly embarrassed and lose a lot of money, basically. So um, justice will be served because they're low vibrational. And it sounds like the lies are going to be exposed. And it's not going to work out well for them. And then they're going to be standing up for themselves in the court of law. Um, I heard they're going to be losing money, too. So um, they'll be um, standing up for themselves um, legally, but it's going to drain them of money. So you plug it in how it resonates. They could be dealing with a Libra as well. Libra and energy. They could have Libra in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or sun, moon, Libra, Jupiter, if, if they are. If that's you or somebody you're connected to. All right. Let me see if I pull one oracle and then we'll close it. I hope this reading helped you guys. Spirit messages you have for this sign up, Leo. One particular Leo is about to be involved in a murder trial, whether they want to be or not. For some Leos, this will go well. For some, it will not. Oh, my God. Whoa. I heard one particular. Um, so, well, it sounds like it's two or more Leos. So. Some Leos out there in the universe somewhere are about to be involved in some kind of murder trial energy. 
Um, for some Leos, it's going to go well. For some, it's not. Um, but whoever is involved to be involved, involved in this murder trial, I heard they do not want to be involved in it. But they're going to be involved whether they want to be or not. And some Leos, it's going to go well for them and some it's not. So, my gosh, I wonder if one of these Leos is a murderer. Um, I hate to say that. Or an accomplice or an accessory to um, homicide or something of that nature. That's terrible. Um, so, some kind of murder trial energy. Dear God Almighty, you plug it in how it resonates. That's terrible. Whew. Number 24. A Leo is about to get a visit from the FBI soon. Okay. Some Leos, they will like this. Some, they will not. Okay. Wow. I heard a Leo is about to get um, a visit by the FBI soon. For some Leos, they will like this. For some, they will not. And a particular Leo is about to get protection. Protection, safe house. Whoa, okay. Heavy FBI energy in here. So at least one of you, at least two of you guys in the universe is about to get visited by the FBI soon. At least one of you guys is going to like it, one of you guys not. And one of you guys is going to have safe house energy. So it sounds like the FBI might put you in a safe house or somebody else is going to put you in a safe house. Um, some kind of safe house energy. So, it, I, but I think it's connected to the FBI in some shape, form, or fashion. So you plug it in, however that resonates, if that resonates for you. And you have the protection card. So just saying, just saying. Number 24 might be very significant. A Leo is about to pay it forward to another Leo in a huge way. Important information to the FBI. Of the past. Okay, so you plug it in how that resonates. Wow, we are going strong in here. So Leo to Leo energy. This could be you paying it forward to another Leo or another Leo paying it forward to you. You plug it in how it resonates, but Leo to Leo energy and um, a Leo is about to pay it forward to another Leo. They're going to, um, sounds like, tell the FBI of some very important situation of the past and it's going to help this Leo out. In some shape, form, or fashion, that could precipice, 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 this, um, say that five times fast. Um, the safe house energy, i.e. protection energy for at least one of you guys. Um, just saying, just saying, possibly. Number 24 might be very significant. Number 24. Um, also, number 37, 38, 32, and 42. Okay, also number 37, 38, 32, and 42. And 29. And 28 and 29. And 27. And 27. Holy crap. So you plug it in however that resonates. If that resonates with you. That could be age of you or somebody you're connected to. It could be possible lottery number. It could be possible date of birth number. Possible social security number. Possible green card number. Um, um, a jersey number or you or somebody you're connected to. It could be significant numbers you're seeing out on billboards, advertisements in some shape, form, or fashion. Number 24 and then the other numbers I called out from Spirit. Protection. Legal, heavy legal protection coming and heavy governmental entity agency energy coming for some Leos. And one, one particular Leo is going to wish they never missed with another Leo. Black magic about to backfire in a huge, huge, huge way. Huge. And one Leo, pregnant Leo, is about to find out they're pregnant with twins. They are going to be so upset. Whoa, holy crap. Man, you can't make this crap up. Dear God Almighty. So you plug it in, however that resonates. My God. So I heard, um, dear God, this is strong. So heavy protection energy, some uh, through legal system. So legal protection energy. Now that could be, you know, divorce energy, amending modification of um, child support or modification of um, custody or modification of um, some kind of modification of legal papers. That could be copyright. Um, 
stuff that uh, copyright um, things, will changes, um, trademark stuff, um, any kind of legal issues, but heavy legal issues for a lot of you guys, if this resonates, I mean heavy. Some I feel it's on a positive side, some I feel it's on negative, according to the messages in here, just saying. Um, you have to plug yourself in however it resonates. And we have murder trial, murder, murder trial energy in here as well. So obviously, one of you guys is negatively connected to some kind of murder. And obviously, I don't think that's going to go well for you in that regard. God, I hope not. I'm just saying. I hope you're not an OJ freaking Simpson. Just saying. Um, but however that resonates, um, some heavy, it's going to be heavy legal protection in a positive way. So you're going to go through the legal system in a positive way. Whether it's trademarks, copyrights, um, modification of custody, um, defending yourself on the stand, murder trial energy, how, however that resonates. There's a lot going on in here. Um, however, the, uh, for some is, you know, maybe it's the legal with the baby. I mean, somebody's pregnant. Several people were pregnant in here. You plug it in how it resonates. But, um We've got FBI energy in here, Leo to Leo to FBI energy in here. We've got safe house energy. The protection could be the safe house energy. Um, and then I heard for one particular Leo, um, black magic is about to backfire on them in a huge, huge way. So they, this is a low vibrational Leo. They use black magic very, very, very heavy. It's, um, for a long time, for a long, long, long time, a long time, and it's about to backfire in a huge way. Very low, low vibrational Leo. Okay, I heard they, okay, so this low, low vibrational Leo used black magic for a long, long, long time. If this resonates for you or somebody you're connected to, but I heard it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Um, and then somebody, so some kind of backfiring of black magic energy that could affect their money, um, their career, their, um, um it could be this murder trial energy for some it could be the pregnancy energy for some because there's somebody uh at least two leos out in the collective that's pregnant but one of them is about to find out they're pregnant with twins i heard they'd be very very devastated so they they don't sounds like they don't want any more kids and they're pregnant but not only are they pregnant they're about to find out they're pregnant with two that could be the baby bump energy as well so you plug it in how it resonates so you're protected from the low vibrational dark arts people the high vibrational leos because we've got a yin and yang mixture in here we've got a lot of high vibrational a lot of low vibrational you have to plug yourself in how it resonates but i feel this is prote divine protection and intervention coming in to balance the scales for the high, high vibrational leos so you are protected you are protected you are protected but for the ones that have used uh black magic and for some i feel it's leo to leo energy they were using black magic on um, but for the low, low vibrational ones, it sounds like karma is about to come around for them in a very, um, very heavy way. But you are very highly protected, high, high vibrational Leo, if this resonates with you. Um, some is safe house energy. Some it is um, protection. You know, you're pregnant. Hopefully nobody will mess with you or your child. Um, um, for some, it is um, it's going to go well for you in this murder trial. For some, it's not. Um, for some... Um, uh like i said safe house energy you plug it in hop bits we've got a lot going on in here all right let me see if i hear anything else okay i didn't i didn't all right you guys i love you guys so much everybody make wonderful choices i hope this helped if you think anyone else could benefit from these messages please share these videos on your social media and word of mouth i'd appreciate it Love you guys so much. Namaste.